Hi everyone, and welcome to another episode of Metro Exodus. So, last time, we got our new mechanic, and we're trying to convince, or we're about to try and convince Miller to let the civilians come with us. Hey, Arturo, see how it all worked out? Have a seat. Okie dokie, I sure will. Look, we have an opportunity to cross the bridge without an assault. There are trade caravans going up the river, and the bridge dwellers do business with them. So, disguised as such traders, we will infiltrate the bridge and lower it. Katya says it still works. They won't be able to stop us if we move fast. And should they try, we'll cross it no matter what those fanatics think. They want blood, they will give it. So now, we only have to wait for the traders' boat. Colonel, sir, we can't just leave them here. They will be eaten alive. Stepan, did you ever try using your head? Do you know where we are going? What we are going to face on the way there? Where, pray tell, are they going to sleep on the Aurora? Atop the coal crates? We Spartans can handle it. But for a woman with a six-year-old daughter, no less, this is unacceptable. I'll give them my bedroll and move into the stove. You will fall asleep and get your throat cut the next day you'll get guard duty after trying to sleep there. Still, I, I know we can't leave them. Let's just collect that carriage Katya told us about while we wait. We can't leave the child here. And anyhow, how long are we going to sleep in turns for? Are you starting that again? How? How are we going to collect that carriage? I'm not taking the Aurora there. Oh, you don't need it. I have a rail car hidden in the terminal. It can tow a carriage like nobody's business. Artyom and I can go get it and, and bring the carriage back. No way I'm letting you go. It will take us both till morning to finish the repairs, and I can't handle it myself in time. Okay, okay, have it your way. I'm done playing the monster here. We get that carriage. We take the civilians with us. Artyom, will you handle this? Listen, Artyom, if the caravan is sighted, drop everything and rush to the port. It's our best chance of traversing the bridge. Okie dokie. Thanks, Dad. Katya and Nastya will be so grateful. Here, Artyom, it's a breaker for the rail car. It won't run without this. She's a real babe, Artyomich, no two ways about it. We went to hell and back, her and I. So much stuff you hold, so... Many tight spots she saved me from. Look, Atyom, since you're going to the terminal, hear me out. It's quite a distance away, and look, if you go at night, there's less of a chance you might run into bandits. They stay at their camps when it's done. But it's not gonna be easy either, since more beasts come out, and there are also electrical anomalies. The fanatics call them the demons of electricity, so you should think about your options before heading out. Artyom. Duke is on a mission in that area. He's keeping tabs on the bridge. Reception is bad there. We get mostly static from him. Anyway, if you meet him, he'll update you on the latest developments in the terminal. I bet you've conspired with Anna and Stepan. I care for those two no less than you. But we don't know if what's ahead is any better than the fanatics. I guess we'll have to live and see. Well, let's be honest, leaving him here is just, it's just not a good option. Great job persuading the old man. Yeah. Check out my setup here, Artyom. I finally got everything the way I wanted. A proper workbench, with storage space for all my tools, and some to spare. You can clean your weapons and make ammo for them here, just like with any other workbench you might find. My gun rack is only available here on the Aurora, though. I'll keep samples of every gun you find, and you can exchange them whenever you want. Always in their best working condition. Oiled and shiny like new. <laughs> you will have to install any attachments again, though. I am going to make you all competent gunsmiths eventually. Okay. I like that Listen, idea. Artyom, I have something for your Tihar. You can try installing it. Use the workbench. Well, I won't keep you here any longer. Cool. Um. 
Better make some bullets for that, I suppose. Um, right. We're going to put a better stock on that. That lowers the rate of fire. Oh well. I don't tend to hold the trigger down. Oh, I got a trophy. Oh look, and now I've got... Now I can swap my guns over too. Okay. I'm happy with this one, so let's clean it. I was thinking about swapping this one over for a revolver. This already is a revolver? I thought this was one of them. So the revolver is a single... Okay, fine. Whatever you say. Air type pneumatic system works pretty much like the standard one, but it doesn't lose air pressure above normal. Perfect. Let's get that installed. Oh, does this hold more? Ah, uh, holds more. Cool. Doesn't need cleaning. Happy days. Just repair my mask. Right then. Now well, let's get into it. Anna, thank you and Artyom for helping us. I don't know what would have become of us without you. It is a cursed place. And that's Silentius. Don't thank us before it's all ready to go. It all hangs on Artyom now, so wish him luck. Of course, God bless you, Artyom. And you, Stepan, thank you. Oh, it's... I don't even mention it. Uncle Artyom, Uncle Artyom, are you going on a mission? I sure am. I just wanted to ask, there, where the big tanks are, if you find my teddy bear, just in case you do. Could you bring him home? I'll sure Our try. Took him, a flying one. It was scary. They live there. It took Teddy to his children. <sighs> I miss Teddy so much. I wanted to go visit him, but Mom won't let me because there are electric demons too. I'll... I'm telling the truth. They come out at night and they light up. So pretty. I will do what I can. Too. A bit. Okay. So how am I getting there? I'm guessing I have to take a boat. Because I can't see us walking. So I think I have to take a boat. Atyom, uh, I haven't really thanked you properly for saving me from that stupid cellar yet. You know, I didn't even get scared when I fell. Because I knew you'd come and save me no matter what. Thank you, my love. Now, go. Come back soon and stay away from the hot spots. I will do my best. This rain's horrible. You might meet Duke there. He's got an observation post set up in a carriage near the bridge. Ask him for a cigarette before going in. Okay. One more thing. The tower to the right. See it? There's someone over there. I think it's the bandits. They are watching us. Okay. Thanks. I've already been over there. So... I wonder if they've come back. I hope not. 
Don't forget to save your progress. I've been doing that regularly. I'm not a fan of this rain. Not a fan of these guys either. No, can you? Thank you. Honestly, this gun is the stupidest thing in the world. Not you as well. At least I got that one in one shot. So are these guys still gone? It seems like it. No one's getting cross. What the earth was that noise? I don't know. Well, let's look for this guitar that they wanted. Then we've got to try and find Teddy. Well, I say got to. I mean, we don't have to. Well, I think we will. Oh, no. Is that the Zarfish? Ah. Oh. I think that's not where we're going. Um, is the guitar in here? It's got to be in here somewhere, right? There we go. Does that mean I can use the thing now and find out what's over the other side? I don't know if this is a good idea or not, but... I want to know what's over here. Is this where I need to be? Eh, not quite. Oh, more of you guys. How did that miss? Fair enough, it wasn't his head. I get that bit, but... God, these guys just wobble about so much. There we go. Where'd the other one go? That wasn't the other one. But it was someone. Is that the other one? I don't think so.
Why didn't I that noise? I was hoping there'd be a boat around here. Unless we can walk over here. We can walk over here. Arbil, Miller here. Transmitting Duke's coordinates. He's keeping tabs on the bridge from there. Meet up with him. He'll fill you in on the latest developments in the terminal. Miller over and out. Okay. Guessing both of these are going to be empty. Yep. So we want to use that, but we need fuel, I'm guessing. Fuel. Fuel. I don't know what this is for, but... I'm getting a lot of stuff, so... So you control something in the house. I was trying to use this. Because it's got power now, right? Or am I missing something still? Okay, so we're not using that bit. I must be missing something. Oh, there's a boat here. Are these guys friendly? Sorry. Lord on Well, I'll be. He doesn't turn his satanic light on us. His gun is holstered. He's a human after all, even though he is a heretic. He has some sense even. His soul may not be completely lost. You wish. Do they even have a soul, them heretics? Look at his armor. Yeah, that's a work of Satan, all right. I wish our paladin said something like that, though. Of course, blessed by Father Salentius. We'd never have lost the train depot or the tower to those bandits. We'd still have it all, and they'd all be in hell. We'd be cutting them down like dogs. It is temptation. Temptation by technology and its satanic power. You're right. But really, damn. All right, bye, guys. I'll leave you to it. 
I did very much expect them to try and shoot me, but... Oh, now they've said they've sent me packing. I mean, I just chose to leave you guys alone. But anyway. So what am I supposed to be doing here? Because I thought I'd need to turn this on. Now that this was working. Because I've got the power working. Oh, is it this one? Okay. So that opens this. So step forward. I would fear the fish. Not gonna lie. It is scary. There we go. They are talking some garbage over there, aren't they? A true believer doesn't even get splashed seems unlikely but hey they can believe what they want to believe let's get this going they'll be very upset about this we starting even more of the electronic stuff does that mean this has got back yes there we go I figured out the puzzle in the end. No clue what's in here. Uh, what were you doing with dead people? Did I want to come in here? He's on fire. What on earth was this guy doing? I got some kind of upgrade. I think it's a battery for my light. But yeah, that was... Uh I mean, worth it for the upgrade, I suppose, but creepy, nonetheless. Have I been in here? I didn't come in here yet, did I? Did I? No, I sure didn't. Ooh. What are you? You are a shotgun. Tempting. I already have a shotgun there, actually, don't I? Ooh. I can't argue with that. Is that just not, that's just an island in the middle by itself, is it? Or 
Where am I on that island? I'm on that island. So what's that? That's the power line bandit tower. I sure will, bud. What's this place? Oh, so this is the end of... Okay. It's like the peninsula of the bit I'm supposed to be going to. Gotcha. Keep eating, don't let me disturb you. Why am I supposed to be going? Oh, he's given me the thing for what's his name now. Um, Duke. Duke's over there, isn't he? That's where they want me to head. Oh, that's a bandit place, isn't it? Can I walk along this? <laughs> That would be a yes. Cool. Oh, not these things. I don't like those things. Let's go see Duke. I think he's in this thing, right? fill you in. The terminal can only be entered by water. Luckily, there is a dock with a boat nearby, left there by the fanatics, it seems. Inside there are just those, uh, um, humanimal mutants, or so it seems. See that gas station? It's a bandit hideout. They ambush the fanatics. These guys seem to be drawn to the terminal like flies to you know what. The bandit caught three of them on my watch. Look at the building over there. Bandits keep captives there for ransom or something. But they sure go to town on the poor guys. I asked the colonel for permission to go in three times. But no dice. I understand why. But we have always protected common folk from low lives like these. So I'm having a hard time staying put. Oh well. See those ruins? There's a bandit camp there too. They have a sniper. I saw at least one scope flashing from the roof, so I wouldn't advise an open attack. The bridge is in full lockdown. None of the armed dudes ever show themselves. They definitely expect us to attack, so there is no reason to be concerned about them now. Hey, it's your choice when to move out, but the bandits should be easier to avoid in the dark. In any case, I'm going back to my post. Okay.
Um, did I get? I got. Oh, I got the battery, didn't I? Let's make sure we install that. Um, battery charge control: an electronic circuit designed to manage the battery charge process, improving its efficiency and making the batteries last longer. Yes, please. I'm debating whether or not I swap this for a shotgun, but it's my only suppressed weapon at the minute. Well, actually, no, that's suppressed as well, isn't it? But should at least clean it. Okay. So, we will continue next episode. And what my plan is, is we'll do all this optional stuff. So we'll go to the warehouse place over there. We'll take the ruins over there. Then we'll go to the gas station and the thing. And we'll also get... um. Get Teddy as well on our way through and uh, yeah we'll see how all that goes fingers crossed it will go well so that's our plan for next episode if you enjoyed this one hit the like button below and let me know what you thought in the comments and join us next time for the next one